This is Shuttle Launch Control at T-minus three hours in holding. We're entering the suit-up room now at the astronaut quarters in the Operations Checkout Building. Here's our commander, Ken Ham, who has spent 13 days in space aboard Discovery on 124. Here's our pilot, Tony Antonelli. This is his second trip into space, having flown as a pilot on 119 aboard Discovery, which delivered a space station integrated truss segment and a pair of solar generating wings. Going over now to Garrett Reisman, MS-1 aboard Atlantis on STS-132. He'll be performing spacewalks one and three. He holds a PhD in mechanical engineering and spent three months in space aboard the International Space Station. And here is Steve Bowen. He's the first ever submarine officer selected by NASA to be an astronaut. He's mission specialist number three and will be doing two spacewalks, EVAs one and two. This is his second space flight, having flown previously on Endeavour. Piers Sellers, this is his third space flight, having flown on STS-112 on Atlantis and 121 aboard Discovery. He's logged 41 EVA hours in six spacewalks. And Michael Good, making his second trip into space, having served as mission specialist uh, number two on this mission. He'll be doing spacewalks on EVAs two and three. And here comes our STS-132 Atlantis crew, leaving the suit-up room, headed uh, now for the elevator. And much of the astronaut uh, support personnel in the ONC giving them a goodbye as they leave. And here they come. Spacer employees are always invited to wish the crew well as they leave for the launch pad. And they'll be escorted out to the pad by a NASA security van, as is customary, behind them. There they go. 